video, you're going to learn how to add your autoresponder to a page so you can start collecting leads and then those leads can get your email series. So for example, there's all kinds of email camp or autoresponders that we've already built here. Let's say I want to add this new campaign to a page. Well, the first thing I want to do is click view and look at campaign details and make sure the status is active. If it were set to inactive, that can mean people could fill in the form, but they won't get any messages. They won't get messages until it's turned on. Turned on means active. Okay, now that we know that, the only other thing we need to know is the name of it, which was new campaign. Okay, that's what I want to know. So let me go into page builder here. You want to go to your pages that you made. And let's say I want to connect that to a page. I want to connect it to this page right here. So when they fill out the form, they're going to get my email series. Over here to the left hand side, you'll see something that says mail campaign. When there's a drop down arrow, you click that and you'll see every single AR that you've ever made. Usually the very bottom is the freshest one. And there's the one I want, new campaign. So I select that and then I hit save. Now an error that some people make is they try to fill this form out in the editor. Well, this isn't the page. You can't, you can't fill this out on this page. What you need to do is you need to go back and hit get link find the link open the page up because that's really your page don't use the editor link or some people will, will copy copy and paste what they what they see above here which is the editor link that's not where your page is you got to click and actually go to your actual page uh, to test that but that's how you connect it so now if i were advertising this and they filled this out any person that filled this out would be on the mailing list new campaign and start to get those messages very very easy